Welcome back to Myth of Empires. Excited to get going today. TBF Gaming jumping back into one of the biggest survival games I've probably ever played in terms of depth and things going on here in this server. It's been absolutely wild. Now, you guys know we're playing on a private server that's for our community as a patron server. We have been playing with the settings nonstop for the last week or so. This, is, this video is recorded earlier in the week. It's not going to come out until Friday, so this is a few days off. But basically, we have been nonstop playing with settings, trying to get everything kind of set up to where people can actually solo the game just a little bit without breaking the game completely. One thing that we're working on right now is we are making it to where you can actually have more subordinates. You can still only have two guys out actually running around, but now you can actually have more guys at your base. That way you can put a bunch of guys on benches and actually, as a solo player, still kind of really experience the game. And that's kind of what we're working towards with that. So it's been a lot of work to do that. Last few episodes, we worked on a lot of things too. We worked on, we got the fox pen going. Unfortunately, the foxes all died. I'll talk about that in a second. The rabbit pen is almost, they almost all died, but they're going okay now. We're back up to six. We were down to the final two. Luckily, it was male, female. They're back on track. We got a ton of rabbit hay. We're never going to run out of rabbit hay, but we're doing okay over there. I am expanding the back side of the base because we are playing mostly solo. We have the guild over there. I think Goat plays quite a bit and Drew plays quite a bit, but the other couple people in the guild are kind of off and on here and there. So it's basically just a, a couple of us still kind of playing in the guild. In terms of the server, there's still a few people across the map. Uh, there's actually some really cool bases out there that we'll check out a little bit later in the season. Now, we're going to try today to do a couple things. First of all, this is going to hurt my feelings. I hate doing this. one of my things that I don't like that I can't seem to fix in the settings. I can't get the return for items to be any higher than like nothing. Look at that. We get so little back when we break something, but we got to break these real quick so I can pull all this, do that, break this guy. Where are we at? Break that. And I've got new ones to go ahead and put down. Did I already grab them? Yeah, we did. Okay, cool. We'll put those down in just a second. Uh, is that part of it? Okay. We're good to go there. I, I also want to eventually do the sawmill because I hate how it's all catty corner like that. But it's not a big deal. But we eventually want to fix that. But we've been expanding there. I also expanded the gate on this back side over here. So we got the gate all the way across to there. We're good to go there. On the other side of the island, you can see in the middle, Goat built up his little base right there. And then on the far end is the guild base. So we're doing pretty good in terms of taking over this little island in the middle of the map. This is a really cool location too, by the way. Very beautiful area. Very dangerous. All the bad guys over here at level 30 to 35, some up to level 40. And all the crazy animals, very high level. Up here, there's tigers. Over here, there's elephants. We've got a little bit of everything on this map. This has been a lot of fun. But anyways, we've been messing with some of the other settings. I did up some of the production stuff, so we should get better production out of this. I also didn't realize that you can change what you produce out of this. You go to the basic mining hut. Oh, hold on. Basic mining hut choose to mine the mineral and then you can change it to copper and now he'll pull copper out i didn't know that we should have had a ton of copper iron we're good to go but copper we were falling behind a little bit we also got a couple of our guys doing the recruiting down here we're cruising on that unfortunately i tamed a recruited a level 36 i can't get her off the bench until we get to level 550 in recruiting which we can't do until we up our stuff but i did make changes to that as well it's going to be much cheaper to actually upgrade your stats past 450 if you guys don't know the way it works in these skills so let's go to one that we've already got maxed out let's go to agility and riding riding we got maxed out to 450 450 is the max that you can go to before you go and pay and do missions to upgrade that stat so right now we're at 450 if we go over there and do some missions we can upgrade it a little bit higher i don't know how many times we have to do that because i haven't ever done it before but we're going to get a chance to do it now because i decreased the cost to do it by a lot like uh, at least at least like it's down to 10 percent of what it originally was i think because we're trying to make it to where you can actually afford it as a solo player which i only have a couple thousand coins we also found a way to make a bunch of money we're going to try that today but let's go ahead i need to make a bunch of rails before we do anything else so i need a bunch of walls so i need a ton of that a ton of that a little bit of that and all of that right and then I need a bunch of walls. So let's make 30-something walls, maybe, possibly. Boom. Can I still move? Ah, we can. Nice. We also made the new crop plot. i got to put the new crop plot down. I've got the old crop plots picked up and, and remade. We're going to try those ones as well. Wait, did I do it? Hold on. Wait, maybe I didn't. Where's that big crop plot in here? There's the water. There it is. Okay. Oh, I haven't clicked it yet. Let's go ahead and click that guy. 
All right, that guy's going in a minute. We'll have the bigger crop plot. I haven't checked this out yet. That's common farmland instead of the crude planter. I'm hoping that we can have both down. That'd be awesome. This is going to be end up being our little garden area is what we're going to try to set it up as if we can. But let me go ahead and get these walls down so we can go ahead and continue to expand all of this. So go like that, like that. There you go. Awesome. Don't need need that, but I just think it looks way better, and I tend to fall off things, so this is just a good idea. Was that all of them, or did we just... No. Oh, uh, we don't have foundational support there. Okay. We will work on that. Don't have foundational, foundational support there either. Okay. Okay, we got to fix some foundational stuff. That's something we can work on. Uh oh Oh, we almost lost stuff. We don't want to lose anything. Okay, now we can move the tannery back to the backpack. And try and line that up and line it up this way. Go back as much as you can. Boom. Looking beautiful. It's not too bad, right? I think that looks pretty good. And I want to keep the stone mill kind of close to it. This thing is a pain in the butt to place. Because you need lots of space. And we can't quite do it. If it's next to the rail, you can't do it. But we can go right there in the middle. How's that? I just don't like how that looks. I think it looks awful over there. Let's go over here. Okay. All right. Hopefully when it's moving, we can still do the thing. Okay. Those are good to go. Now let's go see if that crop plot's about done. We're going to put that down real quick. We're also about to make the next bow. We did unlock the next bow. We've been doing a bunch of just little unlocks in between uh, episodes so we can kind of work on just slowly advancing. And we got ourselves in the weapon category. We unlocked this one here, which is the weapon mold Scythian bowl. Scythian? I'm not exactly sure how to say it, but we unlocked that one as well as the, the crossbow, some iron arrows. So we get into iron arrows soon. That's awesome. Let's go over here. And our buddy Nevada, you're going to craft these up for us. We want to make the bow. For that, I need horn and tendon. Four horns, three tendons. I think I have that. I know we've gotten it at one point. Horns and tendons. Do we have horns? Do we have tendons? Not in there. Uh oh. Maybe we don't have this stuff. I know. Wait, wait. We got six horns, six tendons. Oh, we might have it. We might actually have it. Okay. Let's run over here and throw this in here. I'm going to throw that in. Throw that in. We've got the bow. Boom. 45 seconds. The bow will be good to go. Oh, that's awesome. Okay. Let me wait for that. I'll be right back. Okay, hopefully I remember to go back and do that. We, we had to go outside and stomp our dog. Our dog was protecting the house in real life. So let's go ahead and grab the new bow. Boom. Why do I have that there? I'm not really sure. That might have been... Oh, we made the armor before up here. Okay, okay. We'll check that out a little bit. So now we have the mold. We should be able to bring this over here. Hopefully I have everything to do this. And boom. Go like that. Confirm. There we go. Awesome. Uh, whoever put animal fat on here, thank you. I didn't have any on there, so thank you for that. There you go. We got that coming up real quick. Level 31 bow. Awesome. Oh, well, let's put it here first. Put that down there. Nice. Let's take a look at the new bow. All right. It looks pretty epic. Cool. It looks a little smaller, doesn't it? Looks like we're a little more compact. I think so. All right. So that's that. Let's go ahead and grab that crop plot that we just made where is that at common farmland okay now i don't know if i can put this on i'm hoping i can put it on foundations and ceilings i don't actually know i don't know what size it is oh 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 okay so this is an actual oh common test farmland Oh, no. How do I do this? Hmm. I would like to make this my farmland right here. So we're going to do this. This might be a pain in the butt to do, but I'm going to move this. We're going to take that. Okay. We're going to say, hey, buddy, you can stop working this for right now. Stop working. Yep. Stop working. Dave. There you go. By the way, check out Dave. Dave has been doing things. He's been over here working harder than anybody on the server. He is currently in mining. He's up to 690. I didn't know they can go past 450 apparently. 
All right, we got that. I actually made another mine, so we're going to break this down. I thought I could put multiple mines down, and then we learned that we could only do one. So that is something we learned today. Get that. Okay, oh, we are very, very overweight. So we'll Baywatch walk it in real quick. I will go put down all these materials, grab the other mine. We'll get Don't Die Dave back to work right over there next to the... We'll just move it, like, right there. We'll get that going, and then I will see if I can put this common test farmland down right there. I don't know how big it is. I hope we have room for it. Uh, we can actually do this to be able to move a little better. Let's go... You know what? I've never done this. Can you lock a stunned warrior? Hmm. Oh, that's for, yeah, that's for the warriors. Okay. Wooden barrel. Oh, you know the other one we have to make? I need to make a water barrel. So let, let me run inside because it's going to take me just a bit to get inside and drop all this inventory. So I'll be right back. Also, our weight is increased to 400 and something. So we can actually carry a lot of stuff. Same thing. Just another thing we're doing to kind of make it a little bit better or easier for single players. But yeah, j just keep in mind, a lot of these changes, I know some people are going to, it's going to bother them like crazy. Most of us here don't have the time to know life hit like on a server. It's it's still pretty unforgiving. I lost all my foxes. I've lost a, a ton of warriors because I didn't have enough food to feed them. We're still struggling, but it's just a different struggle. Okay, we can finally move. I accidentally called my guys inside. Everything's fine. Let's go ahead and grab the twine. We need twine, and I need the flagstone. We'll grab that. There you go. That should be everything we need to make the well as well. We'll get that one going. Uh, flagstone, twine, and make of the well. Awesome. Okay, that's good to go. So this common farmland, let me kind of read this because I don't understand how it works. Use the collected grass and branches to make a base farm that can be used to build the field. After the field area has been selected, use the farm tool to hoe the land. After reclamation is complete, you can begin to plant crops. When created, this item can only be used... By this guild, not other guilds. Each tile cannot exceed 15 units in an area. Interesting. This is really interesting. Huh. So I'm wondering, like, how far can I go with it? That's what I don't quite understand just yet. Like, how far does it stretch? So can I go, like, all the way from right here? Oh, I can do, like, everything. This is weird. So from, like, here... Oh, no, did I just... Okay, I was going to say, I didn't place it, did I? Okay. Okay, so I can go that big. That's it right there. Oh, my God, that fits perfectly. Look at this. I couldn't have planned it better myself. Okay, the only thing... I wish that it was... Lined up a little better with the base. But that's pretty freaking good. No, it said no. Collision error. Okay, let's try this again. We were so close. Hold on. I got too excited. My fault. My fault. We got too happy. Three. Like this. Come on. Go by five. One, two, three. Come on. Like that. I just don't like how crooked it is. Should I get rid of two of these foundations and move it over just a little? Let's do that. Oh, man. See, see how bad the return is on these? I'm trying to find the setting that changes that, and I can't for the life of me find it. Maybe we'll get lucky. Okay. Let's do this one more again here. Oh, that's why. Oh, that's awful. We can't go up and down on that. That's horrible. Hmm. And I'm sure I can't. Dang it. Okay, we're making bad choices all over the place right now. All right, let's try this again. We're going to get this to fit in here somewhere. What's cool is it looks like we can go like crazy long with it, so we can go anywhere. Okay, but if we go like that. One, two, three. All right. Like that. 15, 12. Can I not go one more this way? Oh, exceed maximum. 12 out of 15. Like that. That slant is awful. Okay, there's... 15 there. Oh, oh. Oh, you can adjust it after you place it. Okay, this is really cool. 
It's going to take me a minute to kind of figure this out. Let me <laughs> fix that foundational issue. That absolutely sucks. Okay, 10 minutes later, I finally got it down. So now, I guess we have to cultivate the land here. I really didn't want this outside the fence. This was not supposed to go down here. I'm really bummed about this. I, I just, I couldn't get to place anywhere. We kept retrying it and retrying it, and this is where it ended up. I guess what we can do is, man, we can move this entire fence out a little bit, but that's a lot of work. So now we need to get the the hoe, and we need to actually cultivate the land. So now we sit here and do this. Oh. Oh, it might be like a one-and-done thing, though. That's kind of cool. I assume we still got to go through and get the porosity good to go on each one of these little crops, but this is awesome. Okay. Okay, this is kind of cool. Now, what I'm wondering is, can I have this down and the five crop plots down? Because if that's the case, we can actually go pretty pretty nice over here. That looks good, man. I like it. Okay. I don't know if we can do multiple of these or not, or if it says there's five of these. I don't know which one it is. Okay, so is the... So the porosity is not good. So we actually have to go... Oh, come on. How much is it per swing? Oh my god, is this a real thing? Oh my god. This may take 10 years. Holy cow. Can I assign a worker to this? If this is the case, it's not worth it. Unless it's doing the whole thing. Oh, it's doing the whole thing. Aha. Okay. Well, it's time for me to put something on my mouse and go AFK while this guy hose it up a little bit. Okay, I don't know that I like this as a location for it, but we got the porosity up. The moisture is good to go right now. I guess we put the well out here. Do I have the well yet? I gotta go grab the well. Man, that is not where I wanted it, though. I really want it within the grounds here. So I, I guess I can grind up to get another one, but let's at least use it while it's there. And we'll just not put the water well out there just yet. Uh, I'm just gonna take a minute to kind of... Oh no, why are you not... <laughs> can I get you back through a door? I'm a little worried this guy can't ever go back out. He might just live here now, buddy. So let me see, how bad is it to get another one of these? I think it's very expensive and I have nowhere near what we need. 200 sand, I can get that pretty quick. Vegetable oil is going to take just a minute. Actually, though, I did get a little bit more recently. But vegetable oil, we can definitely make some more of that real quick. And then what was the other one? Wood ash, I think I have. And grass doesn't take too long. So I guess it's not horribly bad. Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't mean to do that again. No. No. There's no way to stop it, is, is there? Oh, man. I did not mean to do that. Gosh dang it. That's just a waste of supplies. Okay. Well, that happened. All right. Uh, let's see. We got the bow. We've got everything else. It should be getting light again here in a minute, so we're going to wait for the light to come up. Let me go at least plant those crops out there, at least get them rolling. I guess we can go ahead and throw that water thing down now, too. So we need the big ones that we seem to need a lot of early on. Right now, we're needing... Oh, can I do the common now? Common soy? Common wheat? Common rice, maybe. Nope. Sorghum. I don't. I haven't needed sorghum yet, but I'm assuming I need it soon. And then flax. I only have two flax. Wow. Is that all the flax seeds I have? That is. That is extremely unfortunate. So I need, I need more flax seed. I guess we can plant a little bit and then hope that we get a little bit going. So let me go work on this. We'll see how many this is. Hopefully this is worth it. It's a lot of soil, so I'm hoping we'll do these all two flax real quick. One and two. That's really pathetic. And then we got our eight of these. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it's ten, ten wide. Nice. Okay, that's not bad. Now we got 64 of these. So one, two... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I just wanted to verify. And then that's one, two, three, four, five, six. So 60. 60 total crops. That's pretty good. So this will help us definitely get like on track in terms of crops. So we'll be good to go. Have a nice little farm going. And then we just need to continue to work on our army and start going into some of these a little bit more difficult places. We did go into a copper mine a couple days ago. If I have that video, I'll try to link it in here, but I don't remember if I was recording or not. We were kind of just goofing off with our friend Drew, and we went into a copper mine and kind of just ran through it, hoping we would get a key or something like that. We didn't get anything really cool. Another thing we do is we found kind of a good way to take these guys out. Let me show you the method for this. Do I have a bronze? 
I've got a bronze chain. Let me see if I have an open spot for one. I don't think we do. How are you doing? Oh, 100%. Were you recruited? Were you recruited? Okay, so those are actually both done. I can break them off and we can go get ourselves a new one. So let's go. Oh, man, I'm so bummed. We broke the fox thing for no reason. Absolute bummer. Okay. So the fo fox thing is broken. So don't die, Dave. Just for right now. Can I put you just on here to get you secure? No, not like that. Hold on. Go like this. Boom, boom. Just for a minute, Dave. Just to get you out of the way. We'll put you right there. And then... Figure out where we're going to put the mine now. But the main thing is we're going to go ahead and get ourselves a new warrior. Alright, we are slowly gathering some of the things that we need. I went ahead and got the grass. We're good to go there. We have the wood ash. I think flagstone and probably planks is where we're going to be short. But we can work on that pretty quickly. We'll go get a bunch of wood done. Do stuff like that. We'll get through it pretty quick. It's just going to take a minute to kind of regather all the things. But I, I really want to make sure that this crop plot thing is more inside of our little walls here. We definitely chose kind of a tight little area. I guess if we went down to the maybe to the bottom, we could do a little more. I definitely wish I could make those on. Okay, of all the things that we do or don't have, the only one I'm missing is the vegetable oil. So let's go ahead and get that going. Throw all that on there. Looks like we can make both of those. So let's make... A good amount of this first. We'll go 40 of that. And then whatever's left over, make it into that. Nice. I'll give you 40 and 47. Uh, we could move that dude over here. I got to get the thing going again, too, in here in a second. Got to get the mine going because we're wasting a lot of time where it could be gathering for us. But we want to get this other crop plot made up so I can kind of figure out the situation for where we're going to put everything. And we're not too far off. Once that's made up, oh, we're good. We have everything we need. I just need 22 more vegetable oil. And then we're good for another one of these crop plots. Uh, and <laughs> what I don't know is we might only be able to put one down. That's going to make me a little bit sad. It's going to be really sad if that's the case. We need 12 more. So we got to wait a minute longer on that one. While we're doing that, let's go, let's go ahead and get the mine down. We absolutely need the mine down like now. I like having it closer to the base. What we could do, I was wanting to reset this one anyway. It can go, it can go anywhere. I wonder if I can put the mine there. So let's grab everything out of here. All right, this is another device that we'll have to remake. It's going to be a little bit sad. Carpenter's branch destroy. Oh, my bad. No, 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 no. It would kill the warrior if we did that. Isn't that crazy? Okay, follow. Follow. Okay. And then go like this. NPC stops working. Now we go demo. There we go. <laughs> uh, what a mess. Everything we do, man, it's a little bit messy. All right, so now I know we have to mine first. So let's go get the actual pick and see if we can pick a spot right there. Like so. Oh, no, over here. Grab our pickaxe. There you go, pickaxe down. And as close to here as possible. I'd also like to go ahead and move the kiln, but that's another thing we'll have to break down. That'll make me a little bit sad as well. Yeah. Dang it. So there is kind of the best place. So you can't do it on these rocks. Got it. Hmm. You can do it. Man, because I don't want to do it there. I think we can fit the crop plot thing in between here. So maybe we do it like right here. Okay. And then maybe it'll go a better direction this time if we go like this. Okay. That's actually better. Dave, what are you doing, man? Get out of the way. There you go. All right, you, man, you're getting back to work. You are in the way all the time. There you go. Don't die, Dave, is back on his thing. And for right now, I'll go ahead and give you my scorpions. You can eat those. All right, get to work, Dave. Okay, and then that leaves that little space there to try to get that crop plot down there again. So we'll work on that. Let me grab that vegetable oil. And then we'll go out and do a little bit of adventuring as soon as we're done with this. There you go. There's 30. Perfect. Grab that. And then I'm hoping that crop plot out there actually grows things a little bit faster. That'd be awesome. So let's go now like this. Where'd that go? Vegetable oil. That one, that one. Let's 
get all that stuff put back. Got it. Okay. Now, can I make that crop plot? Boom. And what would I need to make the saw carpenter bench? Carpenter bench. Carpenter bench I can already make. Boom. Okay, let's go ahead and stop that. All right, carpenter bench and the other one coming up. It'll just take a couple minutes for that. I'm going to work really hard to try to get this crop down in an area that works for us. And then we'll kind of go from there. But there you go. That area is starting to look a little bit better so we didn't have that kind of little messed up fence all around there. I'll do some more railing and stuff up here. But yeah, this this isn't too bad. And really, I'm, I'm thinking we might eventually enclose this. This might be in a little enclosed building area as well. I haven't decided yet. But I think this would look cool as like a little lodge right here. We'll think about it. Because if we did that and I could put the forge right here so we could transfer super easy, that'd be kind of awesome. I don't know. We'll think about it. What does this say? Hopefully the... Oh, proficiency. I was wondering if proficiency started over, but it didn't. Okay. Right, I'm going to work on this crop plot for a few minutes, guys. I'll be back. All that struggle, I finally got it down. That took forever. Now, the next thing I'll have to do is see if we can actually get the, the little ramp there. If not, we'll figure out an alternate path around. But there you go. We finally got it in there after all that struggle, man. That was a lot of struggle. Now, can I put these crude planters here as well? Because that'd be kind of awesome. Or do they actually need to go? Looks like they actually need to go on here. I wonder if there's better planters may later. Maybe that's a thing too. But if so, if we put these over as close as we can to that one. So we can have it all kind of here together. There you go. I wonder how many of these we can have in a row, the actual crop plot stuff. That's kind of crazy. Makes me want to like completely decide a, like a design a new place. There we go. There we go. Got it. All right. It looks horrible. We completely are off center. It's driving me crazy. Ugh, we're going to have to remake that too. All right. So I have to pick this out. That's something we'll have to work on. And then this thing can go away. Break that up. All right, we need to go recruiting. That was a lot of time spent on just a couple really simple things here at the base place. We've got the lumber mill coming up too. Yeah, I don't like those at all. That's all going to have to break. Got a couple coins. Oh, yo, yo, you got all of them. Okay. Oh, and of course you give me the, the highest level. There was no giving. You took it. <laughs> Hold on, we're going, we're going spear. Stop shooting me. Yeah, you were wrecking some people over here. Oh, we got plus one hostility with the rebels now. <laughs> it's going good. Nice. We got it. <laughs> Couple coins, little copper. Coins, copper, and meat. Did you get that other one you were fighting? Uh, I think so. I think I got all the... Yeah. Yeah, no, I killed him for sure, yeah. Okay, we made a good indention into um, it. Did they just replace... No, no, they don't. They don't respond that quick. I think. <laughs> really? Oh, headshot! Take that. He can't throw around. Oh, he got one off. Oh, I missed. <laughs> He's like, ah. <laughs> he still likes me, though. I've shot him about 10 times. Oh, copper ingots off that guy. All right, we got. One, two, three, four, five left total. 
I'll face, uh... Oh, my shield's gonna break, so... Nice. Uh, he's coming. Maybe. Maybe not. Oh, that's fine. I'll shoot him with an arrow. You can headshot him, you just can't. Just aim slightly above his head. I say slightly, it's actually pretty high above. <laughs> Yeah, the arrow drop, you gotta aim about That's an inch on your screen it? above. What'd you say? It's a what? Oh, I thought it was a boss. Oh, no, my bow broke. I'm out of bow. Dang it. I got a spare. No, we're good, we're good. We can we can fight him up close. It's fine. Alright, I'm going spear so I don't take any damage. Oh, yeah, you almost wrecked this guy already. There you go. Focus on Drew. Perfect. One down. This guy is in love with you, man. Nice. Good job. I broke my armor. <laughs> oh, he had salt. Nice. Not enough, but. Alright, we got two, three. The level 19 on the right. I assume he's the boss. Okay. Oh, wait. Hold on. You want to pull this guy to the left first? Yeah, yeah, let's pull the guy to the left. There you go. Or you can <laughs> not wait for me. That's all right. Throwing rocks at him. Pretty big deal. Nothing. Okay, come on. Oh, he does 40 damage. He actually does a little more. Ow. Oh, he's a colonel. That's why he did a little more damage. I know, right? <laughs> it's fine. I'll, I'll poke you while you're focusing on you. This might be the actual boss. I don't know. Oh, you knocked him down? How'd you do that? Down. Get him, get him. Oh, well done. Uh, nothing special, just a little bit of salt. 137 coin, though. I didn't take too much damage. How are you doing? You're doing great. Damage? No, no damage. My gear is broken, but that's not biggie. All right, we got the fit. Upgrade anyway, so. 15 and the 19. The 19 looks like a big guy. Oh. There you go. Just one guy up. Come on, one guy. Let's do the same thing. Bring him over here. Yep. Focused on you. Nope, he cares about me. No, he's on you. Nice. Oh, that dude was so focused on you, we were good. Uh, 45 coin. Okay, you can shoot this guy. I'm not messing with him yet. <laughs> Alright, let me get my pole ready. Oh, he, he moved right when you did that. He looks awesome. Level 19, though. We can, we can get him. Oh, what does he throw? Rock. He's a level 19 throwing rocks? Rebel Colonel. Yeah, another Colonel. Oh, I shot you. That's fine. Yeah. Ow. Okay, I'll, I'll drop this way if you want to keep shooting him. Yeah. Why does that one blank narrow go? There he goes back to the rocks. <laughs> he does a lot of damage on the rock. Jeez. Ow. We're doing good. We got it. There you go. You keep stumbling and that's perfect. Get him, get him. You do a lot of damage, man. What kind of sword do you have? Alright, that was all you. you. You got that one. 
Anything good? No. Cloth, copper, coins. All right, let me bring the horse in. If nothing else, we can load it with a bunch of copper. Yeah. No, that would be nice. Oh, I can sit through this whistle. All right, All right. yeah. Come on, let's go. Did I bring that key with me just in case? I did. There's a chest here. Is this a level 30 well, we didn't get that I can get key, into? So. Yeah, yeah, I can unlock it. Oh, you nope. can. Requires key. No, nope. I guess I can't. How did we not get a key, though? Okay. Well, I'm, I'm not 100% so. sure how it works. Like, we definitely it's search not a key everybody. every time. Maybe. Okay, it took some work. We've got the crops down. It is looking kind of good. We've been picking them up a couple times just to kind of test it out. I'm not sure how the water works just yet. It doesn't seem like it's filling it up, but maybe it is. Like, it's definitely going down. I'm not 100% sure how this is working, but hopefully that starts filling that up. Or maybe I need to actually have buckets in there. I'm not sure. I don't think... I think the other one that I saw was actually moving. So maybe I'm doing something wrong with it. Maybe I need to move Dave over there. Is it something that I can work on? It might be collect water yeah, i don't know let me double check i think i can also assign a worker to the crops but let's go ahead and grab our two other warriors in fact before we do that no let's do that first and then we're going to go get a new guy i'm going to show you the new method for grabbing a new guy this new method works really really well so let's go warrior recruited and who do we got here i don't even know which one this one is i think we're going okay we'll go ahead and release him I'll get him a name here in a little bit. Right now, I just want to get him free from there. So let's do that. Are you not following? I thought you auto-followed. Let's go like that. Like that. Like that. Boom. Okay. Close that. I shouldn't have that open. My fault. I'm going to try to equip this guy onto the farm. I think I've got clothes for you. Do you need clothes? Yeah, we got some clothes that we can throw on you real quick. Grab these. And one, two, three. These clothes are really funny because they actually give them hair. Well, this guy already has hair at least, but some of these guys don't seem to have hair right away. What are you doing, man? All right, inventory. Go ahead and equip. Equip and equip. There we go. Brand new guy. Awesome. And I think I haven't tested this. I'm pretty sure I can have two at a time now. Let's double check. Let's see if it lets me. No, not like that. Where you're recruited, and let's see. You know what? That's actually perfect. Is this a male or female? I think that's a female. So let's go. Want to test this out? Go ahead and go like this. Untie from rack. Boom. There you go. So we can actually have two of them out at a time now. Let's go ahead and get her to follow us. Not Vegas. The other one. Raider, follow, follow. All right, cool. We got two of them now. So we actually grabbed two of those ones. The one over there is a leader. I, I'm hoping we can get that one eventually because that one's awesome. There you go. We got a male and female crew here. Let me see if I can assign one of these as a farmer. That'd be awesome. Can we do that? No. Come on. Open inventory. Working. We're going to go you. So he does the, the crop stuff. I don't know if I need to give him the right tools or how that works. It doesn't tell me, so I'm not 100% sure there. And then do I need to assign you as well? Well, working. There you go. So if they can get all that going for us, I think we need a bucket in there. It keeps telling me I need a bucket. I don't even know how to make a bucket yet. But all right, while they're sitting there doing their thing, we've got the metal recollecting over there. We've got, you should be training. You don't have any food on you. We're kind of at a shortage for food, so I need to go hunting for a little bit today. But before we do anything else, I want to get a couple warriors thrown over here. Make sure I've got my club. All right, we've got our knockout club. I've got a couple weapons we can fight with. We should be good. Now, what we do with this, our friend Goat built this really cool little spot over here. And this is how we've been knocking guys out we get them stuck into this little thing here it works amazingly then we pick them up carry them across take them into our little hr section add them as a recruit to the team it works really well it takes a few hours obviously several hours for them to you know recruit up or whatever but that is not too bad at all 32 32 i need to make a periscope so i can actually see 39 we can't quite do anything over 35 we can't touch yet there's a 34 that wouldn't be too bad well, let's go like this. Can I shoot just you? No. Oh, wait. We don't have our bow ready. Okay. Let's 
go like that. Boom. All right. Hopefully it's just the one that's coming. This is actually how we defeat the mine, too. We tend to do this every so often. We might do this again here soon. All right, is that one not coming? Come on, man. We shot you so you would come on. Okay, well, that's not working like I wanted it to. Okay, let's try this again. I swear it works better than that usually. Dang it. All right, it's going that way for us. Oh, no, it triggered a couple of them. We got to be careful because they can still wreck my face. They're pretty decent levels. I hit one of them. We got three of them coming right now. Okay. Come on. Oh, that'd be perfect. If we can get both of them over here, this would be actually really cool. There you go. That dude's throwing rocks. Oh, man, he's wrecking my face. Okay. I'm going to try and get behind this. Get these guys over here. At least one of them. I need one of you guys over here. Oh, wait. Hold on. One of them de-aggroed. Perfect. There you go. Come on back. I was throwing rocks, too. Okay, this might actually work out without having to put him in here, but I still want to show you the method. This just works really well. We don't have to worry about getting hit too many times. Oh, my God. We're going to die from rocks, though. Hold on. Come on. Come on. Oh, my God. My top broke. That hasn't happened yet. There you go. Yeah, we got him. Okay. I can't believe our top broke. Those are so expensive to fix. All right. Now, we can try shoot this guy in the feet a couple times. Obviously, leg shots are not ideal. We can also creep up and do, hold on, let's switch to the pole arm, a little bit of spear action. Plus it levels up our other stats, which is great. Okay, we gotta be careful because I am very low health. Oh man, maybe one more hit. Now let's go ahead and be safe and we're gonna switch to this one. All right, switch it. Got it. Missed it. Come on, man. <laughs> I have not hit him yet. Come on, man. Come on, dude. Why can't I hit you? Okay, we are not having much luck here. I definitely didn't have this much trouble last time. I don't know. Okay. I'm going to keep trying. Come on. Here we go. Okay, we got him. Don't hit him again. Don't accidentally hit again. Move away. <laughs> Here we go. All right. Now... Go like so, like that, and pick up. You can see how fast their torpor just goes crazy. All right, now we hightail it. I can't believe we're shirtless. We run back over to the other side, and we throw them on one of the benches, and then we're good to go. We let them do their thing. We go get another one and do the same thing, but I think I'm out of bronze ropes right or bronze chains right now. We're going to have to go get another one of those going. But as long as we kind of stay focused on it, we've been able to do this almost every single time without too many fails. I've had a couple that got free. But it's starting to work pretty good. I want to outfit this into a much better little thing down here, too. I want, like, four or five of the better benches, so we'll work on that. Uh, Vegas. Vegas is level 45, by the way. Vegas is killing it. Doing absolutely amazing as our HR recruiter over here. All right, so they'll recruit that one. Uh, I do need to make sure there's food in there, which is probably not. There's a little bit. Okay, we're good there. And let's see if we can get one more. Then we'll have a couple people recruiting over here. I can't believe our armor broke. Man. I didn't even know that it was getting low, and now I see the color down there on the left. I didn't know what that meant the whole time. 
Uh, just for temporary. Just for temporary, we're gonna wear that. Okay, to make another one of these, I need copper and twine. Okay, a little bit of linen. Which we have a little bit. Alright. Linen. And then we need, I think, straw rope. Boom. Like that. We just need a couple twine. And a couple copper ingots. And then we're good. There you go. A little bit of copper. Boom. Got it. Okay, cool. Let's go get one more. See if we can recruit one more. I'm going to try and recruit a lady out of there. There you go. Boom. Awesome. Yeah, we have a, had a little bit of trouble hitting there in that time. That was kind of a bummer. It's almost nighttime again, too. I spent a long time working on the crops and stuff like that, so we're definitely behind. The one out here, and I want to see if it finally grew. It did. So is the water out here finally doing its thing then? Let me see. So, no, see, it says zero moisture. And now because of that, most of it is weak harvest or it's not growing. All right, I need to see about getting a bucket. Before we do that, before I get unfocused again, let's see if I can make a bucket to throw in there. I assume it's not hard. Let's see. So where's that water well at? So water well. Where would we make a bucket? Having that warrior there actually does it. So let me see. Oh, well, you know what we're going to need? We need food in there. Uh, okay. Hold on. We got to get food on both those guys. Otherwise, they're not going to work. We know better than that. Do I have any food available? We've got that. Let's get it going. Okay, really quick. We'll get some food going, and I'll do a quick check-in on a couple things. All right, go like that. Come on. Go like that, like that. There we go. Food going. Food going. Okay. All right. I can throw this on. This should get these guys going, and then our crops are good to go. I think. Like that. Inventory. And... Like that. She's doing it. Okay. And then hold to open... Okay, inventory, and warrior food, let's just throw all of it on there for now, okay, okay, they're working, now what I'm hoping, does he gather it, or do I still have to come gather it, I don't know, but it looks like, looks like this is going to work, alright, we'll keep an eye on it, hopefully it works out, so that's that, let's go recruit one more friend, and then that's pretty good for today. I got to go back out and get foxes again. We got to work on that. Let me see how the rabbits are doing. They've been collecting for a long time now. We're doing great on that. The amount of rabbit hay is insane. Everything else is going at an okay speed. We're up to seven. Mood is a little low, but habitat comfort is high. We just need to add some more of the good food in there, which I have here. Add food. And see that? It goes up every time I do that. There you go. I'm going to throw a bunch of those in there because I want their mood to go up. There you go. Make... Happy rabbits. Oh my god, I'm stuck. Okay, I need to get like on a straightaway so I can use these buttons. There you go. Keep hitting with that six key. A six does like the straightaway jab. Perfect. Makes it a little bit easier to use in these. There you go. What about the eight key? Maybe. Oh, eight does headshot damage? There you go. There we go. We're getting a little better. Whew. Gain coarse cloth. Oh, let me see how many we've cleared out. This takes a long time to do it this way. But eventually we have this place cleared out and we'll have like a nice little access to their treasure in there. If there's treasure in it, of course. Alright. Let's go like that. We're doing this all with no shirt. We don't need shirts around here. Okay, he's going to load his crossbow. We're going to shoot him. Okay, let him do his thing. Stab him in the back. There you go. Let's get on this road again. Okay, we're going to aim for his head. We're going to start hitting him with the eight. 
There you go. It makes a big difference. Using the number pad, we're doing way more, and we're getting some headshots in. Maybe it's because we're on that little incline. Maybe that's why. He's blocking like crazy, and we're about to lose our spear. Okay, spear gone. Everything's fine. Okay, hold on. I have to run. <laughs> we gotta run and equip our sword and run again. Yep, get close. No, come on, come on. There you go. We're gonna do the same thing again. This is not gonna last long. Let's see. <laughs> there you go. Okay, you know what? Maybe we should just recruit this guy. There you go, get him with that slash. Oh, he got us. Okay. Come on. Come on. Okay, turn around, turn around, turn around. We're so low right now. This is about to break. There we go. There you go, good shot. Okay, we're about to, our sword's about to break. Let's finish it off. There you go. You know what? We're gonna go ahead since we've got this guy so low. We're gonna knock him out. Got him. Okay, now we gotta carry him all the way back. We're a little far away for this. Hopefully we're okay. <laughs> we were gonna kill him off, but we'll, let's go ahead and recruit one more. I really feel like if we brought someone with us, we'd be better, but if they're doing that much damage, these guys just don't have enough health to take more than what? Maybe five or six shots and then it's over? Especially against a leader? There's just no way. And that's a leader that we have knocked out over there on the bench. We just can't tame her anytime or recruit her anytime soon. Man. Okay, I'm going to throw this last one on. I, I want to get into that Jade Mine, but it takes so long to do it. I don't know if we can finish it this episode. We're still kind of limited for the amount of time that I can record for one episode, which is why we make so many setting changes on the server, man. Okay, run, run, run. We got one more little bench over here on the left side. There you go. Boom. There you go. All right. Now, are you guys almost done? 35%. Hey there, Ned. How would you like to take a break from doing this? Come with me. Follow. Let's go, Ned. All right. Take these guys down here. We'll assign you to this one. Get us another friend. Like that. Nope. Like that. Come on. Sign Ned. All right. I don't know what Ned's skills are like for recruiting, but hopefully it's not too bad. Let's see. No, no, no. Not follow. Inventory. Like so. Like so. So I've done this with him before. So he's recruited some before. He's up to 262, which gives him 72%. And then our friend over here, Ella Face, one of our early recruits. She has been doing this for a while. She's up to 390. So she gets a even better percentage from it where's the hold on i should have looked at it right there it said right there in the thing there we go there 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 you go she gets a 108 so she actually has over a hundred percent efficiency bonus and then vegas is going to be kind of the same thing vegas is up to 45 vegas you're killing it man and then someday someday that'll be our friend okay i think we're gonna have to end it there next episode we're gonna do the selling for gold i'm gonna actually or copper i'm gonna show you guys how we're going to go about doing that. I think we can actually make some pretty good progress with it. All right. Now, how does this work? Open inventory. Aha. Oh, my God. We've got flax for absolute days. And does he replant it automatically? <gasps> oh, my God. We're about to get so many workers doing the farm thing. That's epic. Okay, hold on. I got flax for absolute days. Perfect. Let me check on my rabbits. We need to feed them up a little bit. Mood is a little bit higher now. Food amount 17%. We're doing good. Collecting a whole lot of things. Boom. Nice. Got some crude hide, some fine hide, and animal fur. 
Very, very good. All right, guys, I'm going to end it there. <laughs> I'll get my armor all fixed up. In fact, we made a shirt earlier. It might be ready to go. Let's go grab that. And uh, that one, hide armor. Get over here. Confirm it up. We'll let that finish up. So hope you guys enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm really enjoying this. This has been an amazing patron server. I really appreciate the other people on the server that have helped out and kind of helped us guide us through some of these processes because this game has a lot to it. I'm still learning it. Your guys' comments have helped out a lot too. Thank you for that. Uh, it's been a lot of fun. I'm, I'm hoping to get quite a bit further through it and we'll try to figure out if we can get all the way to end game or not. I'm not sure what the eventual like end goal for us is because I don't think we're going to make it all the way to ruling the entire country. Like I don't even know nobility-wise if we've made any other advancements. We are up to Viscount. We're, oh, we're getting... Oh, no, we're good there. We're working our way towards Noble Viscount, which will give us some really cool boosts over here. So eventually you start getting pretty high up, and then up here you're getting 25% bonus to everything. That's cool. All right, anyways, guys, I'm out. Thank you so much. Later.